Cell phone video capturing the scene moments after an off-duty U.S. Park police officer was shot and killed while inside the Ryland apartment building in McLean, Virginia, early Sunday morning. About 10, other by the end of I me, mean, it was like 14 to 20 cop cars, like yeah. all just lined the whole street, like they had blocked down there to about those pedestrian Fair, signs Fairfax there. Fairfax County yeah. Police and then U.S. Oh. Park Police. Fairfax County Police say this man, Alexander Roy, another off-duty U.S. Park Police officer, is the person who pulled the trigger inside one of the apartments. Investigators say Roy was attempting to dry fire a gun. Dry firing occurs when someone pretends to shoot an unloaded gun by pulling the trigger. But early Sunday morning, police say Roy unintentionally shot the loaded gun, thinking that the firearm was unloaded. Michael Houck says he's trying to grasp what happened knowing that he was on the same floor with his young daughter. It's just me and my seven-month-old child, you know, definitely scary to hear about. I mean, because you know, bullets travel. It's one of the unfortunate realities. It's, like, luckily, we were both safe. Police say alcohol is believed to be a factor in the fatal shooting of U.S. Park Police Officer Jesse Hernandez. At least four people were inside the apartment at the time of the shooting and all those inside knew one another. In total, at least three U.S. Park police officers were inside when the gun went off. Roy is charged with involuntary manslaughter and is being held on no bond. In Fairfax County, Dominique Moody, News 4. Thanks for watching. Stay updated about breaking news and top stories on the NBC News app or follow us on social media.